Ransom's got something. What do you got? Oh my goodness. Hey guys, welcome back to a new video of CC Outdoors. And today, we're gonna be doing the Google Maps Fishing Challenge. Now what the Google Maps Fishing Challenge is, it is a challenge where you basically go on Google Maps or Google Earth, look for ponds, creeks, streams, or what we call them um, slabs, which is a concrete slab that divides the creek a little bit. But today we're gonna be going to one that I found. It's not one that we've been going to, but it's, a, it's one like 10 miles that way. We're gonna be going there, see if we can catch a fish, a couple bass, a couple anything. I mean, we got the throw net, the minnow trap, we got the tackle box, the rods. We got some some bait for the minnow trap. For the minnow trap, casting it and everything. I'm gonna show y'all guys a photo of the slab on Google Maps here. You can kind of see it right there. I'll pop it up on the screen, but but that's what it looks like right there. You can see like a little stream right there. And then that little like road in the middle. That's basically what it is. It just divides it. And uh, we're gonna be going to go check it out, see if we can catch some fish. And yeah, let's go do it. Got a minnow trap we're gonna set out. This uh, Google Maps, I mean, it hasn't rained in a minute. Hopefully we can catch one still. All right, let's set the minnow trap out first. There we go. Perfect. All right, Ransom. Let's try to catch something here. Ransom's got something. What do you got? Ransom, you caught a bass? Dude, that is a pretty looking bass. Oh, I know. Stop <laughs> <Stopped> popping. <laughs> Dang, dude, you caught him in that? Bro, I thought he was a giant. It felt like he was huge. You're like, what is that? It's a fish. I thought he was a catfish. It's a nice uh, fish, Ransom. I'll leave some back over here. At least I'm back over there. I'd release him over here. He has a chance to live longer. What just release him over here. Okay. Well, right. he can just float down the creek too. Who knows what he's gonna do? Dang, Ransom, you already caught one. Like, what was that first cast? No, I There's definitely a snake here too. Google Maps challenge complete for Ransom. I'm gonna try to complete it. I don't know. It's a bag. I have a dead body in there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because this place is kind of sketchy, not going to lie. You got him. You got a tiny, tiny bass ransom. No, you just gotta let it sit on the bottom. Look at the bass. Woo! My Dude, baby. we had an aquarium. Flabs are the place to catch them. Hey, ransom is whooping up on me. What's up? Don't pick them all. Hey, we're catching a pretty decent one. I'll tell you what, this cast isn't so hard. It, like, it won't expand. Let me show you. Okay, Ransom, let's go. This was a fun Google Maps challenge. You caught two bass. I caught a solid zero. But would I recommend coming here? I don't know. It's up to you. I probably won't be back for a while. This was fun. Let's go to the house. Do a verse of the week. Maybe go do a little fishing. 
Hey guys, uh, well we're back from the Google, well this is like a day later from the Google Maps Fishing Challenge. Had a fun time going out there, Ransom absolutely destroyed me fishing there. But we might do a little fishing today, I don't know. But uh, this verse of the week's come out of John chapter 8 verse 12. Then spoke Jesus again unto them, saying, I am the light of the world. He who follows me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have light of life. If you follow the Lord and get saved and do His will, you'll be guaranteed in heaven. And you won't have to ever walk in darkness, which is amazing. So let's check out this boat thing we got going over here. Okay. Wow, a little bit of water. Okay, okay. Still trying to work out some stuff with the boat. Some titling stuff. Once I do get it all registered and titled, we'll take it out and do some catfishing with it. I just gotta let it drain. Well, let's go fishing. Let's see if we can catch fish real quick. I went to Walmart, bought some of the goaded yum, 18 pack, little two inch worms, crappie fishing. But those seem to catch a lot of bluegill. These things are the best for catching any fish. They catch the most fish. This is literally how to catch a lot of fish right here done a video over these before. All right, let's give her a cast. The first bite of the day at the bank. Come on, take her again. Oh my goodness. It's a big old bluegill out there. Sheesh. Tony, man. Can never go wrong with a little jig head and a white grub. Super fun to start catching little fish like that. Because, I mean, you really can't, you just catch them until you get really tired. I want my rod. No! Can put the rod back together now. This thing, I just, it's been broke at the top, but I just throw it in the truck if I ever want to go catch some panfish. That quite literally could have been the only fish in this pond. I don't even know. One day I want to like bring a whole bunch of fish and just restock it a little bit again. Cause I don't know what happened to all the fish in here. They just died. Something. That's one thing I think would be cool. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, comment down below if you've ever found a pond on Google Maps. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.